It's like 50 degrees in my room right now. <laughs> I left the air conditioner on too much, and now it's really cold. And um, I actually woke up this morning, like, and I turned it off, and I, I, I wake up to the sound of, like, friggin' birds smacking into my window, like, it's like they were pissed off that they, I turned off my air conditioner all of a sudden, like, I don't know if they built a nest inside of it or on top of it, but I think they were pissed off I turned it off, and every so often I would hear, like, tweet, 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 smack! right into my air conditioner, and then another one, tweet, 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 smack! And it was just, it, it was the weirdest thing, I wanted to go outside and check it out, but, I don't know, I just turned on fraps and started making a video. So, um, I don't get really, I don't get a lot of mail, because, uh, nobody really likes me, so, uh, I was actually pleased to see that when I saw my mailbox today, uh, you know, my virtual mailbox, my email, um, that, a guy from 8-Byte Network or something like that wanted me to join their network, and I was like, oh, okay, well, that's nice, you know, any any network is a is a nice network, but um, I've had some uh, bad times with other networks, and, like, I have opinions on networks and small gaming networks and just gaming networks in general, and uh, there's just some things that I need to say, get off my chest, and, yeah, but... It's, I'm making it sound like gaming networks are bad. You know, they're really good in some ways, but you have to look at them in different ways and how they can benefit you. It, Not by how you think they'll benefit you. You might think that you'll get um, maybe, like, exposure, but in reality, you're not going to get a lot of exposure. And, yeah. So, um, this morning I got an email from... 8-Byte Network, and I went and I go checked out their channel, and the email by itself was actually very good. It was, like, top-notch, no spelling errors, like, it just it sound, it sounded like a representative from Microsoft sent me the message, but, um, I got the message, and I was like, oh, this is nice, 8-Byte Network, okay, good name, and I wanted to go check it out, so they had, like, six videos, and, like, a hundred subscribers or something like that, and, um, they had this one guy, and I thought it was pretty cool, but that's really all they had. Like, that's it. So, it's very small, and uh, I didn't expect uh, a, a, network as, a network as small as that one to actually come to me and come to that guy, who uh, I think has like 200 subscribers or something like that, um, to build their channel. I think they would have like started off with maybe smaller subscribers and like people who have less subscribers and go to them first, but I don't really know because I wasn't really enticed um, as soon as I saw the channel and there was only six videos. I really, I guess they actually really want me to be a starter and actually start this going. And yeah, so um, gaming networks can be like good and bad. The network that I was a part of, and it was actually sponsored by TGN or whatever, it was like partnered and it already had everything set up for it, and it, it looked great. It On paper, it looked amazing, but it didn't turn out to be a reality. Um, the network was called GUN, Gamers United Network, and it was a TGN network, and it, it was pretty much just your regular average gaming network. Um, they pretty much accept people with low subscribers um, to try to get them exposure. And if you join, you get to make videos with them, and yeah, and you get to post your channel, and you get to meet new people, and that's always good, that's, that's good. So, um, when I did it, um, the leader was very corrupt, and it, it, did, it really wasn't what it, what it was, like, it's hard to really explain. Um, the, the leader really wasn't on his ball, and... Um, you have to send your videos directly towards him. You have to upload your video to YouTube, but unlisted. Then he downloads it, and then he uploads it to the channel. And I didn't really know how networks worked. So when he did it like that, I was like, what the fuck are you doing, bro? And like, he was just like, um, he was a kid, and he used to upload videos using his school's computers. Like, I just thought that was so kinky. <laughs> and I, I, I don't know. That's just not how I would run a network. If I, if I trusted a certain amount of people, I would give out the password. And, um, 
Yeah, but that's a very close-knit network. Uh, Gamers United Network broke up so quickly. Like, it, I only made one video for them, and I was just like, you know what, this network is gonna bomb, and I just knew it. So I only made one video for them, I just didn't want to waste my time with them. And, uh, they, they were all about, like, fake, um, views and stuff like that, like, boosting your views, boosting your subscribers, and networking and stuff like that, which, I'm not a big fan of posting your YouTube channel all over the web. Um, if you have good content, people will come to your channel naturally, not post to, um, TGN.com and 7sins.com. Don't post there. Don't. Because you're going to get, I don't know, you're probably not going to get anything, or maybe you will. It'll just be, you know, random views and, like, random subscribers and people who really didn't subscribe for your content. And you want people who are going to subscribe and watch your videos daily, if you post daily, that is. Um, you want subscribers that are going to watch, not subscribers that are going to subscribe for the number. Because people actually go for the number. And I don't understand that, because what is a number if you're not getting views? You may have mm, 2,000 subscribers, which maybe, hopefully, someday that I'll get to that someday. But um, you'll, you'll someday have a large amount of subscribers, if you're one of those people. But you'll only be getting maybe 100 views a day from those subscribers, because those subscribers don't check um, their subscriber list, like what they're subscribed to, and they don't know. They just subscribe to you just because you said subscribe. So, you want subscribers that are in it for the content, not for the number. Um, back to the network. Um, 8 Byte Network looks like it could work, um, if it, like, because it's at the same exact thing that Gun was. It was a small network, it really had to get, you know, it had to get rolling. 8-Byte Network's not rolling yet, so, you know, anything could happen. So, um, what I wanted to say about networks is that small gaming networks tend to n break up very quickly. They tend to not work. Um, they tend to, like, just uh, lose track of their videos and how often they upload and stuff like that. And, um, you know, 8-Byte eight eight Network could do that. It, it could be a gun network. Actually, Gun Network would be, um, that, that wouldn't be right, because it's Gamers United Network, so Gun, um, it could turn out to be Gun, you know? So, um, you know, what's a few videos, so maybe I might join, maybe I'll just give them a few videos of mine, like, um, I'll, you know, devote some time to them, maybe, if I see that they'll get just a few more people, and maybe I'll join. Um... And this is the part where I lecture you. Um, people tend to join networks to get exposure, but that's not what you should join a network for. You shouldn't j join a network just because um, it's big or it's um, it's a network and there's actually people on it, and they say they'll get you exposure and they say they'll partner your channel. You shouldn't really partner for that reason. You shouldn't partner for those reasons. You shouldn't go with networks for those reasons. It's like, you should you should join networks for the experience of working with other people. Now, I'm, that might sound really corny, but um, right now it's not as hard for me to play with my subscribers, but for people who don't have a lot of subscribers, it's hard for them to find people to play with. Networks like Gun and networks like 8-Byte Network provide people to play with and generally more content to create. And that's what I like about networks. It's not about the money, and it's not about the partnership, and it's not about the number. It's about working with other people, playing with other people, having fun, uh, generating more content, more good content, I should say, because too many networks post shit content. Excuse my language. Um, so yeah, this game is coming up to a close. I lost on the HE grenade. I was that was upsetting because I was pretty close to winning, and I wanted to get you know a winning game for you guys, but that didn't happen. So, um, and here I got betrayed. I don't know why. I just decided to forgive him. So yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, and yeah. 
Cheater. <laughs> 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 